Hello guys, welcome back. My name is Emmanuel Adibayo. So today I'm going to talk about what we call energy, energy when dealing with customers. Energy. Now, our positive affirmation by employee to customer creates a positive image when dealing with customers. There are some words we speak out to customer that create a positive disposition even while on the call, your tone of voice seems to what create a positive image of the brand to the customer. Now, when dealing with customer, there are some words which we ought not to use. Now, your employee, which are your people representing your business, should know how to deal with customer. They should know the words to use and how to create a positive scenario, making the environment look clearing or look happy for the customer. A customer might call into your uh, business to complain about an issue, have it, having a negative disposition, then how would an individual person, uh, the employee, answer that customer? As we all said, we said we, we, we individual interacting with someone, we hear those negative words. When they hear these negative words, their continent change like not, no, can't, wouldn't, we don't offer or, or wouldn't our mind sometimes this customer's mind are becoming what becoming in that call the customer might have becoming clouded with negative disposition meaning since this person is telling me can't wouldn't i can't uh we don't the customer will have a negative disposition negative uh, uh mind so their mind will be clouded at this point they will request to speak with another person but when you have a positive disposition when your mind think is trying when the customer think uh, you are giving a positive disposition she will, he or she will have in mind you're trying to help them now learn to see what see how negative words when dealing with customers your mind should be you know sometimes if you are talking with someone and their thought is all about negativity you become sad or perhaps you become bored when having conversation with such person but when the person have positive disposition your mind will align you gain some positive disposition oh this person is trying to help ah this person in this such scenario so conversation like that creates clouded negative thoughts to the customer now we have some negative word employee shouldn't use when having a conversation with the customer like i don't know so create a positive scenario by saying, let me find out more information for you. Don't say, I don't know. Tell the person, let me find out more information to you. You said negative words like, we don't offer that. You're telling the customer, we don't have offer that. But tell the positive side of the story by telling the customer, let me tell you what we offer. We have similar, um, we have similar gadget like uh, uh, with such you're requesting for. Let me tell you what we offer that. That seems like they have the same features. Negative words like, can't confirm the information on the call. Why? We have other method. You can tell the customer, rather than telling the customer we can't, can't is a negative word. Rather than telling the customer that, you tell the customer we have other method of which you can go by yourself by confirming the information. So tell the customer, sell the self-service option to the customer to make the confirmation themselves. So negative word like is not possible. Why will you tell customer everything is possible with our company? Don't tell the customer it's not possible. Uh, it's not possible. No, negative. Not is a uh, negative way. Have other suggestion. Would you mind? Tell the customer. Be, be someone that is smiling. Sometimes you speak to customer and this customer will perceive your disposition on the call. Your, your, your tone will sound like a smile to them. Don't tell customer we don't, it's, it's not possible. We tell them we have other suggestions. Would you mind if I can tell you that? We have some negative word like, no, we cannot. Why will you tell customer, no, we cannot? No, it shouldn't be that. Positive, like we can, but at the moment we are unable. But we have other option. You say, no, we cannot. Now, why would you say no, we cannot? A customer called to complain that I need a refund of my money. I made a process of a something for so so time and it's over five days now and it's the company's fault. And you as an employee and you think you're right, you, we cannot. You know, our lifestyle reflects how we deal with people 
and it also represents ourselves when dealing with customers. Who you are will surely come out when dealing with customers. So employees should have positive disposition. Don't tell them we cannot. Tell them we have other options at hand. Don't tell them it's not possible. Tell them it's uh, at the moment your option can be done via this method using your internet bank or using you understand you can also request for a refund a refund can be requested from your hand go to that option menu you selected click on it and ask for but don't tell the customer i cannot do that for you okay no have positive disposition positive energy so i hope you will teach your employee on how to align or create a positive disposition to customers via the mail platform, via the call, or via any other source channel customers can contact you with. Thank you for your time. I hope you enjoyed this section. For those that have not subscribed, please kindly subscribe. Move. Let's go. Hi, hi, hi. We'll meet you in our next video. And share, comment on the like, uh, comment on the, on the comment section. Bye for now.